All right, overnight, I uh, cooked up some glass here, and I did a little bit of looking around in the crafts guide. Oh, I don't have any torches. Oh, that's right, I put them... Hey, you must be in here. I put four torches up on the corners there as I was waiting for the night to pass. Um, wait, I have coal over here, I think. Uh, but anyway, I found a new recipe for some lights that I want to use on the top of the tower. Right now I just have torches in the corner, which works. But these these other lights are pretty sweet looking. If I can remember how to make it. I think it was... Oh, you can turn that into a candle. Interesting. I believe this was the recipe. Sticks with torches. I thought that was the recipe. Let me run back and we'll find out real quick here. It's uh it's a block with light in the center. Not that one, this here we go. Light. Oh, two torches and one piece of glass. Okay, well that works too. And gives this one wooden light box. Now I have absolutely no idea what this looks like. That looks pretty nice there. Yeah, I think that'll work well. So, oh, and did I grab the pine? I got some pine wood, hopefully that's enough. Let's go on, climb up here. Yeah, so I put torches in the corners. That was just so I had some light overnight. Mainly so I wouldn't die up here. Which, uh, Something ended up killing me anyways, but I don't know what it was. Alright, so here's here's my idea. We'll do a an outer wall. Will this even work? I wanted to alternate between Okay, it looks like I can't. Good. Uh for no reason other than decorative type stuff. I want to do alternating between the block and the base out here just because I think it's a nice it's a nice mix. You know it does look really nice doing this and I like the way that that staggering worked out so I thought hey why not and you know what I should probably just fill the whole floor in. That makes it safer. Uh, I don't think a trapdoor is really necessary because you can't fall into this because the ladder is a walkable node. So that actually works out quite well. So we have this little outer rim going on here, which is nice. And then I think this isn't going to be enough fence posts. Wait, where did that? Oh, why did I put it there? Okay, so we'll put fence posts in the corner and then on top of that pine wood planks but I feel like that should really be higher but we'll see how this works out because this is going to give you a really small window space and I feel like it should be larger but maybe we can do something with doing an arched system, maybe? I'm all about new creative ideas. I'm not really sure where I'm going to put these lights then, though. Like what, just put a light in the middle there? That kind of blocks the view. Kind of wrecks all of the lookoutness of it. I could put it at the peak of the roof. Well, that we can figure out later. I'm gonna try <clears throat> and use these leaves as scaffolding. Ooh, that's a far drop. Okay. So if we do that, and then we place that there and go across like that and place can I reach? Can I? Yes, I can. Beautiful. Alright, and then go across there. And we'll have to take these back. 
All right, and then I'm not really sure how that connects. Ooh, it's a long drop to pretty much certain death, I'm guessing. I think if I fell from this height, it would be over. I would be a goner. I mean, there's a slight chance I'd survive, but I would not put money on it. My money would be on you're dead. Okay, so we have that. And then, then what? What do I put in this corner? Do I try to do something with slopes? I don't even know how I would reach that. I don't think I can reach that. I'd have to get up to the top here. Hmm, let's let's try this out. Okay, so those are there, and this is set in, so I think this node here is where I would need to stand and jump from. Nope, I miscalculated. It should have been that one. All right, well, let's try this again then. So there we go. All right, so I can get up here now. Would it even make sense? It makes sense to you like a corner stair. Let's try that. Whee! Yeah, there's a risk involved in doing that. If you jump back onto the stair before, or the ladder, before you hit the bottom, you're okay. But if you don't, Woe is you. Okay, I'm just gonna take this with me. So I have a feeling I'm going to be needing numerous different styles of things. And where's my where's my pine wood at? Pine, pine, pine. Let's go. I don't think I'm gonna need more, but I'm gonna grab a whole bunch just in case. That's kind of shaping up. I honestly I don't even know why I'm bothering to put this much work into the roof because you'll never see the roof like literally you, you'll never see it there's no way you could but whatever let's try that gives me one I'm gonna need four that gives me six well what if I don't want six I want four there we go beautiful and I have some leftovers which I'll just leave sitting in there I honestly don't know what you're supposed to do with those leftovers. Feed them to the dogs, maybe? Was that rude? I don't think so. Okay, now. What? No. No, no. Just place like a... Okay, so what I'm going to have to do is put... A block in here and then place this there we go oh man but now I can remove this and it works okay well in that case let's go ahead and just put the blocks in all the corners right away because it'll save me time and then just to make sure I don't step into that void. Man, this is this is pretty risky stuff, especially due to the elevation I'm at. Dude, I'm telling ya. Es mucho peligroso. And for my non-Spanish speaking viewers, which I would imagine is a lot of you, um that just means it's dangerous. Very dangerous. Mucho peligroso. I do like this though. I can see to the land over there. Floating tree because I guess the map hasn't been sent to me for below that. The jungle. Uh, it's not really a jungle. The snowy pinewood forests. And the castle. And of course there'll be another lookout tower over there. Okay, so... I think I'm going to fill these all in, and we're left with a 3x3 three three space, which I don't know. 
I need to get back up there. Okay. So we've got our little corners going on here. Um, we could do some stairs. Like this. And now that I'm committed, I kind of have to. Oh wait, I can't put it there because I'm standing on that. That's silly though, because that these need to be inset. Which means more hackery. Man. Why did I undertake this project? Okay. So we put a stair there. A stair there. A stair there. And a stair there. And then, uh, I guess we'll go ahead and put that there. And the light up top. Jump back down in. Um, these can all go bye-bye. Where's my axe? Where's my axe when I need it? Instead of, instead of bloodying my knuckles, let's use the right tool for the job. And open that up so we have light coming into here. Wow, that's a lot of light bleeding through the roof on there. Oh well, it's alright. You can just barely see the farmer's hut out there, some light on that. What I need now is four more corners. So... I can get two corners, and now I can get four corners. So let's grab those. And that leaves me with no leftover bits in there, which is beautiful. Now, where did my other leaves go? I only have one. How is that possible? And I have saplings. I didn't have... Because when I was digging my lee... Oh, man, why did I do that? It turned my leaves into saplings. I can't climb on saplings. Uh, well, I guess we'll just use some pine wood planks. Wait, uh, I'm going to need the corners blocked off. Except for the corner I want to get up through. Okay, let's use some wooden planks. Man, I am telling you. Major props to the people that build. How do I get back in? Oh, I know how to do that. Major props to the people that build just those gigantic structures. Like, I don't know how you guys do it. I'm going to have to just punch a hole through the roof here, I guess. Yeah. My other option would be to use the home button and go home. Which I could do. Actually, I think I set my home right in the in the ground down over there. So it wouldn't even have been a problem doing that. But I didn't really want to do it. So, so I didn't. All right. So that's open. We have some light down here. I think I'm going to put some super glow glass slabs up in there to give me a little extra light. And uh, yeah, this whole passage thing here, that'll probably just stay dark because it's not like somebody lives in it. It's just so you can observe. I think. No, I didn't. Um... Um, didn't I have, like, a chest I just dropped a bunch of junk in at some point? <clears throat> in the farmer's cabin? Let's run over. Oh, there's a ghast. And for some reason, I don't have a sword. And I think that was, uh, some other monster. Boy, these... These woods are safe. That's why we built this sturdy house for this... This farmer family. You had an empty chest. I... I risk. What? Somebody's throwing snowballs at your house. You didn't even have a bed yet. Hmm. Maybe that's why nobody lives here. Because I don't even have the decency to give them a bed. Okay, well, we're going to run over to the castle, I guess. And look through the chests over there. Could have sworn someplace I had some thin slabs of super glow glass. And I only need four. Where, where are my chests over here? I don't think... Normal glass, but I need super... 
Oh, there was a door here. I could have used that. Oh well. Let's take a peek in the chest in here. I don't think I had any in this. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay, well we can make some. Not a big deal. Uh, I just need to remember how to do it. Glow glass. Super glow glass. And then uh, we'll just go back over to the travel center. Ah, should say the warehouse, not the travel center. We go ahead and plop the saw down in the corner here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, what happened? That was weird. Like I clicked on it too fast. And it broke or something. Anyway, where are my thin slabs at? I only get eights, even though it's only a sixteenth of a slab thick. Tell you, man, they're ripping you off, the Illuminati. Those guys, they're keeping some of your, some of your slab slices. You should get sixteen when you cut something into sixteenths, and you only get eight. It's a downright conspiracy. There we go. Lots of light up here. I have no idea what the top of this is going to look like on the map. Of course, no one should ever be able to get above it to see that, so I think we're okay, but let's look. A lot of light. I don't know, I think it's a good tower. I'd throw some other lighting on the inside of it if I knew where, but nothing really seems to make sense. I guess I could put one. I don't know how much it's going to affect anything, but I'll put one up there. I don't, I don't think it's going to do much, but, and I'll put one on the ground. Just because I got the material I may as well. And there we go. It's a nice little tower. Uh, the roof could be designed better, uh, but you don't really see most of it anyway, so I think that's okay. It would be better if it was using some slabs in the corners and stuff, but it's a roof. Nobody sees it because it's the tallest thing around. Um, the other lookout tower, I suppose, would see its roof, but I'm not too worried about that right now. So that is going to wrap this up. Three videos, and we have a beautiful lookout tower that also kind of serves as a lighthouse for on the beach. At some point, I probably will connect a house to it, at which point uh, that door on the front will be eliminated because access will be gained through the house. But until then, this is how it's going to sit, and I do really like how it looks, so super excited about that. Anyway, that's going to wrap this video up. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.